Okay, so once you decide which picture you want to use, you're going to grab your postcard, make sure it's on the, you have the blank side up, then you'll grab your graphite paper and be really careful. You wanna make sure that that darker piece right there is facing down on your postcard. You'll place it over, your, over the center of your note card or your postcard and then lay your picture on top. And we're gonna be tracing over it. All right, now it's time to trace with your pencil. The most important part of this step is that you don't move your paper, not even a millimeter. You'll notice that I am mostly tracing over just the solid lines, the outline of the fish, and then some of the lines inside, of course. I don't draw every line, I didn't draw the scales, and it will depend on the image that you choose to use for your postcard. Okay, let's talk about how to paint your postcard. Now, I know you guys have already learned a little bit about how to work with watercolor from Miss Gear, and um, look at those really bright colors on my painting palette, and then look at my postcard. The colors look totally different, right? I was able to achieve these really muted colors by using a lot of water and just a little bit of paint. You'll also notice I never go directly from the paint to the postcard. I am constantly mixing my colors on that little piece of plastic to the side of my paint. And I also test what my colors look like on a little piece of watercolor paper off to the side that you can't see. So um, that is a really helpful tip as you're working. Um, Again, lots of water, less paint.